verify if this is a pig or a bear because close up Okay, it's an origami bear, but this shit looks like Smithfield hog right here. <laughs> Alright, what's up guys? We decided to uh, leave the state of Virginia and head down to North Carolina to play this uh, talked about, much talked about course, Ahoski Creek. It's a cold, bitter day, but we got a special guest with us today. Close. All right, we're at uh, hole number three, par three, 230. Uh, you can pipe a sidearm around the easiest part of the bend or just kind of throw a straight shot through the tunnel right there if you want. Woo, that was pretty. Oh man, I'm pushing it back. Uh, All right, guys, we're at hole four, par three. Pin position B, 285 feet. OB at a creek that's probably around 260-ish. Oh god, that's good, Bing. That's money. Oh, yes! Oh, is it? <laughs> this is Bing shot, hitting the hole. Alright guys, we're at hole 5, par 3, 288. You have a snaking river that's along left the pins underneath those trees and everything to the left is uh the snaking um, river which you can go be so you got to be careful oh my God. perfect is that the one you just hit the pole with yeah another one that's like my baby all of a sudden another bing ring pole six par three 318 straight ahead uh, same rules apply left of the creek and beyond to OB. I'm gonna try my new favorite disc. <laughs> this is G Star side. I know, what the hell? That man? I've had for months and never threw it. <laughs> hey, listen here, guys. Keep your disc because eventually you might find a use for it. Yes. You can see the flight in it. Yeah. That too. Hole 7, par 3, uh, 315, currently we have a right to left slash headwind. This is where the open course starts becoming more wooded and similar to Bayville style. Oh, piece that tunnel. Oh my god. What was that? A heat on the hyzer float. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Yeah, so that's what you gotta do. You gotta run stuff. Full eight. What we got here is a double mando, the far tree and the four tree. And then once you work your way through the mando, you'll see in the background a yellow um, band basket. We gotta work our way to that. But get through the mando first. Right. 433 feet, par four. That's nice. Rock three? Rock three. DX. Ooh, pan out. Good hit. Oh, made it through. Come on. Go in. <laughs> it's real reminiscent at the very beginning of something open like Munden. Um, and then. We're getting into a, kind of like a sparse Bayville feel, uh, but for big arm throwers, there's there's an actual blue tee pad which stretches out way a couple hundred feet um, behind the whites. Some tee pads are shared, um, so there are some long um, pad positions, but so far, man, uh, it's 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 not bad. The, the thing that makes me sad is I thought I was I hit the pole. I know. I still gotta go to work. <laughs> Why 
are you on fire today? What the hell's going on? What do you eat for breakfast? Uh, Wheaties, man. That's all. <laughs> breakfast of champions. Man. Yeah, but that's the same breakfast that, uh, uh, what's his name? The, the dude that turned uh, the Kardashian dude. Oh, uh, not that Wheaties. <laughs> uh, the, new, the new Wheaties. I'm trying to remember what I got. Bruce, um, <laughs> Bruce Jenner. No matter what direction we go, look at, look at the flag. Hold on, guys. Everywhere we've been turning, we've been <laughs> facing a dead headwind. So we're at a hole 12, 255 par 3, much like the hole at Bayville on, what is it, 16? 16. Okay. But that goes in. <laughs> that was a nice shot. Guys, we're at hole 13. Remember, this is a um, 22 hole course. Um, this is a par 3, 279. Oh, that thing has a spin on. Get the feeble, man. That was pretty, Greg. I need pretty. something. We're at hole 14, par 3, 216, to an elevated basket. Um, you could run it straight or just run a simple hyzer and push right up to it. Even more than that, come on, Greg. Pro pig down the middle. Woo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> come on. All right, guys, this is hole 15. Um, I don't know where the pin position is because it's so deep in this uh, stack of woods right here. So it's either 246 at the A or B position 303. Um, you just got to get working in, into the forest from that tall pine because everything else is just well guarded. So. Look in there. Oh my God, that looks amazing. Oh. Get in. Get in. You're in. We'll see. All right. As you come up close, you can see uh, how well guarded it is. Even if you try to run the first gap, I mean, it's it's a six foot gap. Uh, <laughs> there's really not a whole lot. Now you can probably see the basket emerging, but you got a six foot gap on the left, and on the right hand side, maybe a ten foot gap. But you gotta get that hyzer in, so I hit like <laughs> I hit some guardians, but you can see how well guarded this place is. It's not uh, any joke. This is the biggest opening on the right hand side. Okay, I'm not mad at that. Hold on. Just to give you a view. This is Bing's look. You got all the guardians, the young trees, baskets beyond. This is the six foot gap and there's a ten foot gap. You got the left oh lane or the right God. lane. And these are, dude, these guys, these are like five, six foot gaps. Um, I mean, insane. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, with a good right. kick. Yeah. I don't know how, but I got up through here. Uh, All right, guys, um, hole 17, 198, par three. Uh, you're going to come off this tee pad and get a side on our turner pretty hard right. Dog leg right. With a raptor. That's still deep, but... No, no, that's good. That's good. Yeah. It was lined up. Okay, that'll line up. Get in. Beautiful shot. Coming to 18 now. Got a really turny 
fairway shot. You can either place it or just try to run the whole thing. Uh, basket's dog leg right once you pipe down the fairway. I got Woo! up, I got up. Oh, how beautiful is that? Bing! Oh, you parked it! <laughs> oh, you kissed it! You kissed it! <laughs> Oh, God. Yeah, this is so odd. So um, coming out here reminds me a lot of Halifax in the fact that it's an incredibly fun course in the middle of nowhere. Um, it's definitely got traffic. I mean, the place is well maintained. Uh, but gosh, I wish if we could move this to the Hampton Roads as well as Halifax. All right, we're getting close to closing up this course. It's been so amazing so far. I've been enjoying myself, me and Bing, and um, this is great open. A little bit of wooded and now we're in, in the woods again and we're at uh, hole 19. Which position are we in? B, B position. We are in the B position which is 242. You want to um, get on the right side and just kind of hide your end. Oh no skip! What, what is on the drive and no skip! <laughs> Ooh, come on! <laughs> hole 20 you can choose left lane or right lane 376 it's as a par 4 okay i'm not mad at that there it is i'm not mad at that oh wow man you're finding out about some discs lately could have used a more stable disc Oh, <laughs> sneaky. Nice. Guys, this is hole 21. Um, you can either throw a turner or a sidearm. It's a hard right turn, and uh, the basket is in a cluster of trees, kind of like an elevated position. It's par 3, 239. Oh, that looks great. Come on, oh, my pen out. So we came out of there real tight and I thought I had a good turn going. I'm, I don't know, maybe about 35 short. Um, see the basket nestled under the trees. Ah! <laughs> Get my par right here. Ah. Alright guys, hole 22, um, par 4, 300 foot. <laughs> the left side is probably a 10 foot and a tapering it tapers as you go further down the line, it looks like from here. Um, the parking lot is OB to the left. They have it roped off. So everything left of us is OB. You'll see the glowing line all alongside of that and then the roads out to the left. That is it, Greg. That's the only, That's thing, it. That's the only thing you can do. Yeah. Yes. Oh, kicked the last, last tree. I got it. It stayed back in the fairway now. Thank goodness. Obviously, the right side's out of question. Even if you make it through that first initial six foot, it tapers all in on the right side, collapses in on that. This seems to be the only kind of fairway chiseled out. Um, so I just opted for a placement shot. And even at that, uh, as you can see, the way this is shaped, you still got to navigate this it's again like a six seven foot gap to get through um okay 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 i'm not so mad right now okay i'm not mad at that oh yeah come on get down oh yeah nice okay i don't know if i'm in the parking lot guys but we'll go We'll I walk. think um, I think you're out, man. I mean, not out, but I think you're in. I think you're <laughs> out. I'm saying out. You know what I mean? Yeah. All right, so I did a flex on a leopard three. See how 
it narrows again when you're exiting and then uh, there's the parking lot doesn't depict anything about the sidewalk so I don't know where I am oh I see where I'm at I have a chance I have a chance Come on, what a anti putt. That was beautiful, Bing. Okay. Nice. All right, so there's the whole OB line. You see the, the glow string. Uh, this is all the parking lot OB. I flexed out the Leopard 3, just missing the gravel lot. Oh my gosh, I have a chance. I have a chance for burn. Right at the wind though. Yeah, and what is it, a headwind? For you, it's a headwind. God. Of course it is. Oh my God! Come on, Gray. Big money. Yes. <laughs> Yeah! Oh, yeah! Good bird, man. Holy shit, I fucking buried this dumb thing. Oh. Woo! Yes! Whoa. Wait, so you parted? Yeah, parted. <laughs> hey! Yeah! Yeah! What's your thoughts so far on this course? What do you like? What do you dislike? Uh, how, how's everything been going for you? I think it's a amazing course. It's mostly open, like the first, I don't know, first, what, 15 or so? Yeah, I'd say, yeah. Mostly open, and it was windy today, so obviously uh, you have to have affected by the wind and the distance. Still fun, I mean, it's not completely open, there's still OB and trees you have to navigate around. Um, that part's fun, and then you get in the semi-wooded, Part that's similar to Bayville and Virginia Beach and then you have some really tight lines in here similar to Bennett's Creek in Suffolk or Indian Town in yeah. Eastville uh, definitely a lot of room to open up your arms for your, your distance and uh, but some shot shaping at the same time I think it's a excellent course so so uh, was it a good choice to come out and check it out it's always a good choice yeah to yeah. check out a, a new course Always a good choice to check out a new course, whether it turns out to be good or not, to play. That's true. That's that's the. Track. At least you know whether you want to come back or not. Yeah, yeah. 